Hello and welcome to the video. It's a beautiful day here in Koh Samoy and yeah the sun's shining and it's going to be a different kind of video. I'm going to challenge myself to only spend 500 baht today and I'll let you know how it goes. Wish me luck. For breakfast I've got a fried egg and the steamed rice. Luckily that is one expense paid for and I don't have to worry about. finally finished I've come in poolside with a bottle of water which was yesterday's expense so I'm not including that and what I'm gonna be doing I'm just gonna be chilling here for a couple of hours just to extend that 500 bar and spend it as late as possible during the day so yeah it's gonna be me for the next couple of hours so I actually done the responsible thing last night and done my laundry I woke up and all my clothes were wet so while I'm catching the tan they could dry so two birds, one stone, and we're saving the money and going longer throughout the day without having any expenses. So that's literally enough tanning for the morning and I'm gonna head straight to the gym with another water bottle, which was yesterday's expense. So yeah, that's it, we're on our way. So I literally just pulled up out of my favourite gym in Koh Samoy and this is my first expenditure of the day. It's going to be $200, not $200, 200 baht for a day pass and this is my first expenditure of the day, leave me 300 baht for the rest of the day. Obviously not everyone is going to be using a day pass or maybe that's a previous expenditure but for me this is priority and today I'm going to do legs and I cannot wait to see what equipment they have. So let's do this. Just finished legs on legs at Star Now Gym. Absolutely exhausted, as you can see, that my top is completely drenched. Um, I'm now currently 200 baht down for the day, so I've, uh, I've got another 300 baht to spend for the rest of the day. Now it's time to head to 7 Eleven and pick up a protein shake. I headed to 7-Eleven. I, ma I managed to pick myself some fried chicken and rice and a protein shake for 75 baht, leaving me for 225 baht for the rest of the day. It's my great fried chicken and rice from 7-Eleven and the protein shake. I came back to the hotel for a free coffee and this is another expense covered so I've still got 225 baht for the rest of the day I thought there was more steps then I got a... oh man that's it perfect in the pool get get some of the sun that's it perfect sun's coming from there get a nice tan I'm all good all good Got to protect the shoulders though, innit? Got to cover them up in water. This is another free activity, still leaving me 225 baht to spend for the rest of the day. That's it, and we'll catch you later. That's it, so I'm all showered, ready, and on my way to go out. I'm, I'm still sticking to the 500 baht challenge. I've got 225 baht left to spend. So I still want to go out, I'm trying to find free motives to do. So I went on Google to find what time the sun sets. And 
and that is around 6 30 p.m it's coming up to five now so i'm basically just gonna get a car and drive to the west coast called lepa noi and i'm gonna sit on the beach and watch the sunset and i've still got 225 baht to spare to Nipponoi. We're on the way to Lipponoi and managed to stop off at 7-Eleven and get a 38 baht toasty. So that leaves me 187 baht to spend for the rest of the day. I've been consistent. Just uh, pulled up to uh, Lipponoi Beach and as you can see yeah, there's only one guy there. No one about and yeah just in time for the sunset. I think it's probably a good 45 minutes or so. Probably to get the thing yeah but it's gonna be a good night, nice chilled one, cheap one too. Camp, uh, Lipanoi Beach is pretty quiet and there's not much to do here. So I was just set up camp or uh, just by this swimming pool and now just play the waiting game. We'll see how that goes. I'll get a video of the sun setting and yeah, nice free, free motive. See, it's still 187 baht to spend for the rest of the night. Just finished watching the sunset in Nip Nippon. What's called Lipon Lipon now? Lipon Noi, and it was very surreal. Obviously, there's a lot of clouds in there, so it wasn't as beautiful as I would like it to be, but still a beautiful sight. There's uh, there was a few people here, but everyone just more or less gone once the sun went. And yeah, free motive. It's uh, exactly what I wanted for spending 500 baht for today. So um, yeah, all you need is uh, a car, but how? car or a bike and that would be uh, previous expenses but yeah definitely get yourself to the west of uh, Nippa now and go and watch the sunset literally just finished with the sunset and we've came to the Kosamoy International Stadium because apparently there's a big event on tonight so I think I'm going to go out of budget today and go and get tickets for the fight and then I'm watching this so <laughs> these are 1,500 baht Nice little wait before the fight. Had my first full fat coke in probably about five years. So let me see how it tastes. It's just as good as I remember it to be. <laughs> and way better than the diet and the zero one what I tend to have all the time. Just whipped up some uh, pai, what is it? Pai Thai chicken. Pai Thai chicken. Gonna dig in. Oh shit, the chicken. Have the nuts, have the nuts, Good stuff. We're waiting for some uh, Korean chicken wings as well. Just a quick little meal before we go and watch the fight. Finished my food. Um, I had a, a, a pan thai, chicken, chicken wings, and a full fat coke. And uh, the person I with had the exact same. And the full bill came up to 249 baht. And so I still fight aside I still am within the budget I spent about 140 baht there maybe even less so I've 
literally just entered the stadium and yeah, we're just waiting for the first fights to start and yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. Yeah, this, should, this should be pretty fun, isn't it? Yes, sir. We are the Thailand Sena. Little half time break, round one over. Who does everyone have to win? Who do you have to win? Gemma, who do you have to win? Please. Red or blue? Oh, I'm going for red, so it's two against one. That's why the red one, Enya's a loser, and Gemma's a loser. of round one prediction of the second bite but the red absolutely destroyed uh, blue knocked him out but we all pulled that fight hasn't started yet this one is a bare knuckle fight they both look like very mature fighters I'm going for the one in the blue corner with no socks who are you going for? same you going for that one Gemma who are you going for? red corner or blue corner? okay so we're all going for blue they know I've won two for two so they're all following me now <laughs> through the second round the person in the blue corner won and yeah the person in the red corner space is pretty bad and I'm free for free and we all got a point that one we all got we all won we're all winners except the red guy <laughs> The fourth fight is about to start and it's a Brit, so I'm not even going to bother asking my players because we're all going to be supporting the Brit. Come on, England. What am I supposed to say? It's coming over. <laughs> uh, she only gone and done it for England. <laughs> This is fight number five. I'm four for four and I'm going for the fire in the blue corner. Who are you going for? Blue, 100% blue. Blue, blue. Who are you going for? Red. Red. Alright, cool. Let's go. Let's go. My lucky streak had to come to the end. Yes, I won. So I'm four for. I'm four wins, one loss. Four for five. I'm four for five as well. No, you're not, man. What are you like? I am. Are you ready? Oh, no, cool. Yes, the last one. <laughs> <laughs> Are you lying? Are you lying to the people? It's the main event of the main event of the show. It's a Brit versus a Thai person. I'm gonna go with the Brit. He's in the red corner. So who are you going with? Blue. I'm going Blue. for the Thai. She's going for the opposite. She's going for the enemy. I'm going for the Thai. Who are you going for? Red. Red. No, come on. Come on, England. Final fight, the Brit one, I was five, five wins, one win. And just like that, the the fights, the event at Samoy's International Stadium is over. And yeah, I've seen uh, six fights today. Managed to pull five, and I managed to get one wrong. Pretty ex good experience, and it's, you get your value for your money paying one thousand five hundred baht. Um, I recommend if you're on the island or anywhere in Thailand, just go and check out one of them events. Uh, I'm feeling lucky tonight, I'm 5 for 1. I might go and put the rest of my bar on black and see what happens. But yeah, this is, this is going to be the end of the video. If you like videos like this, please like, comment and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.